This is the intrinsic value estimator calculator that I built and you can download it from the website www.frips.com that is f-r-i-p-s dot c-o-m forward slash i value i-v-a-l-u-e dot e-x-e this estimator is capable of doing the uh, two-stage discounted free cash flow valuation that we talk about in our uh, videos and basically it's fairly simple to use in this box you can put in an assumed growth rate let's say seven percent you can change the discount rate you could uh, say make this 0 0.05 or uh, five percent discount rate and then uh, in this area here you could put the average annual cash flow or in this area you could put the shares outstanding it comes pre-configured with the craft numbers of 2008 this button takes you, if you press on this button, it launches the browser and you say put in craft KFT and that takes you to the Morningstar website where they have a good page on um, free cash flow numbers for the company that you put in there and usually what I do is take an approximation or an average of the last few years of free cash flow. Continuing, um, once you have these four areas filled in the growth rate the discount rate the free cash flow number and the shares outstanding you can then go ahead and press this number here or this button here called estimate intrinsic value per share and if you enter today's market price of craft and let's say it's about thirty five dollars today hit OK it goes ahead and calculates the figure and from what we can see here starting with an assumed free cash flow annual growth rate of 7%, the estimated intrinsic value per share is approximately $48.46. And you entered an, a market price of $35, so the price to value ratio is 0.72, and you have an estimated bargain of around 27.7%. If this is a high quality business with enduring competitive advantages and honest and able management, based on compounding for 10 years and a purchase uh, bargain of 27.7% and a relative uh, free cash flow growth of 7%, then your estimated effective annual yield uh, for that time period may be greater than 10.3%. And that's how it works. And then this half is simply a uh, calculator on this half of the uh, estimator.